Sit back and relax for an evening with the Thames Men. George, how you doing? I'm Good. George. I'm in Los Angeles. Welcome. I'm Alexander. I'm in San Francisco, and you, you looky, looky, bastard, uh, you've reached the Thamesman, and we're in the middle of Australian Week, aren't we? We are. We're making great progress. Uh, Australian Week two, uh, because we did it once already. We had such great response, and thank you for the responses. They were positive, helpful, interesting. Had to do it again. Yeah, the the first week was. I mean, there are so you've got so many great bands down in Australia that that, that haven't come over to the US or the UK, and they're phenomenal. Um, you know, from uh, Cold Chisel to John Farnham. So anyway, the response was so good, we decided to do a week two. But this is not our choices. No, 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 no. we're not that smart, are we? No, we don't. No. So we got a, we got a smart friend, Chris, who who looked at all your comments, also looked at his own knowledge and put together a great list for us. And so we, we haven't watched any of these. We're going in fresh on every single one. And we just be, we be passing through Australian history again. And they've been fantastic tracks. So, well, I have, we've d derived that you lot did a lot of acid in the, um, in the sixties and seventies. And then the eighties was hard. your decade. <laughs> you were made for the eighties. Everything Australia was great in the eighties. Yeah, well, that could be said everywhere. But anyway, that was very true. Yeah, so they did it the best. They really did. did so. it. You did it the best. So now, I've never heard of this. I don't even know how to pronounce this one. Divinals. Now, yeah, Divinals. So Divinals, I've heard of Divinals, and because uh, it was it was mourned in the in music industry, the uh, the lead singer, uh, Christina Am Amflit, I think, she died in 2013 from breast cancer. Um, and uh, she was mourned the world over because they were a very influential band. And, they, and so, um, so maybe I should sort of give some of Chris's notes about this. And so yeah. this is, we're going to be doing Boys in Town from 1981. Um, and this is where Christina Amphlett on vocals um, and uh, Mark McEnty on guitar were the basis for this great band. They are formed in 1980. So this is early, early on. This is the debut single from what was a very hard rock act. Uh, the sound progressed over the years to be slightly more pop flavored, culminating in the international hit, I Touch Myself. Uh, which is more famous. But uh, this is where it all began. Amphlet initially dressed in schoolgirl uniform, but they decided later this was too close to Angus's schoolboy outfit and moved away from it. But the neon mic stand stayed around. Um, and then, as we said, she passed away in 2013 from breast cancer, sadly. So, oh, she's um, been young. Yeah. So, anyway, so this is uh, Divinals Boys in Town. And I'm kind of looking forward to this because I don't know the Divinals, but the name's always been coming up. So, good. All right. Let's do it. You know, I know nothing, but yeah. every single track we've had, and we listen to a lot of dross, but <laughs> every single, and then a lot of dross gets, uh, you know, t we are told to listen to a lot of dross mm -hmm. from subscribers, but this week has oh, been, no, 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 we never no, 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 but this week has been phenomenal. Oh, brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Yeah. Okay. Are you ready? I, I'm only joking about the dross. Slightly. <laughs> all right count me in are you ready yeah three two one go
Oh my oh, god, I oh, love that. I think that's freaking great. That track. I've never heard that. I bloody love that. That that's that whole Australian thing again, where it's a little bit different, but it freaking rocks. That is a smack on my playlist. That is bang on. She was, was amazing. She totally was, electric to watch. Yeah, I, I, sh- I so I always write notes when we're whatever, but I've just put down uh, I put magnetic next to her. I mean, she she is uh, she reminded me she, her vocals reminded me of Hazel O'Connor. Her style was amazing. Yeah, her, yeah, I loved her hair and her fringe and her bangs or whatever. Her phrasing, her vocal phrasing, and her attitude was coming and her dance. She was she was so good, and the band were tight. It was a really tight song actually the two people in the band that really stood out for me were the drummer and the bass player yeah, yeah. you know it, but it, the end that oh that was really really that remember that was our first time um hearing and you know when you hear a track first time you think oh that's good and you go back and after the third time it's got you that got me the first time yeah no, and 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 that was their debut single killer <laughs> yeah absolute killer you know it was it was and it felt fresh as well you know that was 1981 really? was it and it felt like a it, it, you could that could have come out last year, you know. I'm sorry, but the '80s belonged to Australia. Yeah. I mean, if you think about, you know, like I don't know that band, and then you got John Farnham, and then you got In Excess, and then you know, In the Oil, and uh, right, well, yeah, yeah, know. and 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 uh, Charlene, yeah. and um, you know, Jason. You're a bit I obsessed mean, with that, and if you're going to start mentioning Cell Block H again, I think we need to have a chat. B, you know. <laughs> <laughs> So, no, the eighties belong. And God, I mean, just like I never knew the eighties. You guys rocked it. You know, you weren't ashamed of it. You yeah. were the eighties, and yeah. God, you did it well. Now, what a great time to have been in Australia. Yeah, I mean, like, like I've said it before. I was there in 86, 85, 86, and you killed I had it. the best time of my life. It was yeah, just you, magic. You magic probably time. killed it the day you landed. <laughs> it, was it was the eighties was over at that point, you know. Oh, the seventies, the seventies arrived in the eighties <laughs> with your hair, you know. No, that um, um, I'm going to go back and I, uh, you know, I'm so, I'm sorry these bands aren't bigger over here. They are so so goddamn brilliant. Yeah, and I, I'm sorry that we we're we're only finding them like what is it like. <laughs> 30 years later or more know. you know what i mean it, it, it but hey isn't it great that we can find music we've never heard before and and be blown away by it you know it's like it's like oh, the, it's like the I hope, you know if you brilliant. could like and subscribe we'll blow it out even further and you know it, it's hopefully we can bring it over to the us a bit more because <sighs> that was really good that was really I, i'm completely in love with that track yeah i think we should i'd love to hear what other divinals you know, because that obviously they're, they're a band who had a great history, and uh, you know it, what what's what uh, what other divinals should we check out? Because I would love to hear some more of that. Because that had that kind of punky pop rocky kind of thing going to it. You know, a bit the of stranglers, a bit of squeeze, a bit yeah. of yeah, you know. Yeah, yeah. Well, uh, that was a good that strangler squeeze, well spotted, and not you know Hazel O'Connor feel, yeah. which know. I was it was well in my pocket back then. You know, yeah. love that sort of feel. So. Um, so we've got the last day, people coming up tomorrow, and I'm going to be sad. Uh, you know, do we do well? First of all, what do you think is going to be the last track um, f- from this uh, most amazing curated list by Chris? And also, dare I say, do we do uh, a week three? Also and week if three. so, what would the seven tracks be? Well, I tell you. It's been a, it's been as a, as a com, a part, what do you call it? Compiled week or whatever we call it? Or curated. It's been curated. That's it. Curated. Sorry. Yeah. But I knew it began with C. And it, it, brilliant. Really fun. Really, really fun doing this. Great energy. Great tracks. I love discovering this stuff. So. And then we've got, uh, we've got more curated weeks coming up um, by uh, one of our subscribers. Um, we've got Bowie week coming up. That's going to be fun, actually, because I'm, I'm, yeah. I really need to know more about Bowie. So I can't wait. I'm a that. huge Bowie fan, so I can't yeah, wait. Yeah. And then, then we've got Prog Week, which is curated okay. again. So also, I mean, the email's down there, the, the new tennis. And if you've got, if you've got a curated list, 
and you can send us notes on it uh, and it's a list that we like and we we feel that it's it's well thought out and whatever that i would yeah i'm all up for these curated weeks they're fantastic so we've got some great up. suggestions and uh, hopefully we can get to some i we need more hours in the day basically i know so that's what we need. i know i know especially when you think you you know and then you find a band like the divine also it's like god damn it i'd like to do this all day every day yeah exactly well if we got more subscribers uh, and if you hit the super thanks button, you know, maybe we could uh, make it a full time gig. You never know. Oh, yeah, so. super thanks. There you go. All right. What will the final track be for the curated list on the Aussie Week 2? Clue. It tomorrow? was heavily recommended by all of you. So can't wait. Here's a clue it's not the Wiggles <laughs> or Ralph Harris. Okay. Are you ready? <laughs> he got bang. He got you treat. He what? He got you treat. What's you treat? Operation U Tree. Oh, yeah, oh, you that U Tree. I thought it meant like yeah, 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 yeah. He lived yeah. in Henley, and they banged him up. And they banged him up. Yeah, well, to, Jack, to well he gave it away with Jake the Peg. <laughs> <laughs> Read between the lines; it's all there. It's all, all right. there. It was always there. All right, are we ready? Yeah. See you tomorrow.